Welcome to this very important playlist about solving equations. And um, if you look at all the videos, yeah, and in total that's not going to take too much time, yeah, at the end you'll be able to solve with confidence and without a problem equations similar to, for instance, 5x minus 1 equals 2x plus 7. And um, for some of you now, looking at that, it looks very difficult and perhaps a little bit intimidating, yeah? But I'm going to show you step by step that you have been solving similar types of questions already for the last few years. Because, do you remember in, uh, in primary school, perhaps year one, or maybe even in FS, you had questions like uh, two plus dot 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 equals five. Yeah, do you remember types of questions like that? Or maybe um, uh, the workbook you had was like three plus, then you had just this little square, yeah, empty square equals um, four. Remember those types of questions? And then you would say, well, um, the answer is three, yeah, and the answer is, is one. And that is what algebra also is all about, okay? And step by step, you will note that because now rather than those dots or rather than the empty square, we are going to say two plus x equals five or three plus x equals four, yeah? So rather than those dots or the empty square, we are going to use a letter, x or a or b or c, yeah? And in my previous videos, I showed, uh, I, I, when I introduced the language, we have said what we call those the, the variables, okay? But it's not something new, it's not something to be scared of, okay? So, just a few example questions before we go to the next uh, video. Let's say I have uh, x plus three, equals 5. So the question is, which number? Let's call it x, but if I plus 3, I get 5. Which number plus 3 is 5? And then some of you already say, well, that is 2. Yeah, that is 2. And indeed, the answer is 2. And why is it 2? And that's what I'm going to show you in all the videos, is because I take away the 3 here, and if I do the same on the other side, 5 minus 3, that's why x is 2. Last example, let's say a plus 4 equals 9. So which number plus 4 is 9? And then you start thinking, and some use your, uh, still use your fingers, that's fine. Then you say, well, A is 5, because 5 plus 4 is 9. Okay, go to the next video, but it's vital that you realize that solving algebraic equations is something you have been doing for the last few years already. So don't worry about it. Yeah, and I'll see you at part 2. Bye-bye.